Hey guys, it's Sarah. I'm just going to be doing a quick haul video for you guys from Family Dollar. I actually filmed this video yesterday and I edited it and I have been trying to upload it since last night and it just would not export. So here I am refilming it. Um, so I'm just going to try to breeze through this as fast as possible and not edit it so that I can get it up for you guys. So. Um, I'll just start with this because I opened it. I wanted to show you guys I got two rolls of paper towels. I obviously took one out, but two rolls of paper towels for $1.50 from Family Dollar. So I thought that was a pretty good deal, especially if you use them for cleaning. I mean, they're not bounty. They're not the best, but they work, and you don't really have to feel bad about using them for cleaning and throwing them away, so I usually grab cheap paper towels for the purpose of cleaning. And then, in this bag, I guess I'll show you these first to get them out of the way. I just got two cans of Comet, and uh, I always pick up Comet and Ajax when I go to the store. I only got one can of Ajax this time because I have some cans of both at home and I have more uh, Ajax than Comet right now. So I just grabbed two Comet and one Ajax. And then I got a bottle of Original Dawn dish soap. Always need this for videos and stuff. And then I got, where is my oh, brush? That must be in another, there it is. Okay. I got this little accent rug to do carpet scrubbing videos with, possibly. So I'm excited about that because I'm not going to take the chance of bleaching or ruining the carpet in my house. So I just bought one of those to do that with. And then another scrub brush to go with that. So this I think was a dollar fifty or two dollars, and the little rug was I think eight dollars. Then I got this Garnier Sleek and Shine shampoo. Uh, I got a request to use this in a video, so I went ahead and picked it up and. You guys will be seeing a video with this coming soon. And there's my receipt. Then I got, sorry if you can hear my air conditioner, by the way. It's really hot in here, so if that's distracting, I'm sorry. I'm trying to get through this as quick as I can. I got these two tubs for a dollar a piece. Um, I figured I could make, like, paste making videos or cleanser play in these, so I thought those would be good to have for that. And then in my next bag, wow, I'm already halfway through. In my next bag, I picked up, um, here's some cornstarch. I got a request to use other powders like cornstarch and laundry detergent and things like that in my videos. And I got a request to make a cornstarch video, so I picked up some cornstarch. I got this four pack of Family Dollar brand all purpose sponges. These are not scrub sponges, these are just the regular cellulose sponges without the abrasive side. I actually really like these. Um, I have a, I had another two pack that come with sponges that are a bit bigger than this, but this is, these are the same kind, but just in a four pack. I believe these were $2.75, something like that, not over $3. I showed you one of these in my last haul video. This is just one of those um, dual action scouring sponges. Uh, I have the same one, like I said, that I showed you in the last haul but I just picked up another one to have because I think they're so cute, especially the gold ones. I picked up this Gain scrub brush because in one of the recent videos that I did, my scrub brush with a handle like this 
uh, I had to get rid of it. It was, I, it was, I used it until I couldn't use it anymore, and I had to throw it out. So I just got a new scrub brush. I think this was two dollars. So then I just got a, another pair of yellow rubber gloves, latex gloves, these cleaning gloves by Soft Scrub brand. Um, I picked up a pair of these from a different brand in my last haul too, but I can never have too many pairs of cleaning gloves. And then I was looking for the green and yellow heavy duty cellulose sponges that like Scotch Bright makes, but I usually get the Family Dollar brand because I end up destroying them. And they usually sell them in a two or three pack, and I couldn't find those there. Um, I, I could only find the sponges that are not the cellulose kind, if you know what I'm talking about. So I looked down and I found this weird bag of the sponges that I was looking for. But they're in a bag like this instead of the little packaging that they normally come in. And there's six of them in here. And I believe this was $1.75, $1.65. So that wasn't a bad deal at all. So I picked those up. And the last thing in the bag is these Gain Steel Scrubbers. So I got these, obviously I got all this stuff for videos, but um, these are different than the ones that I have because they have what looks like a sponge in the middle, if you can see that yellow thing. Um, it looks like a sponge in there to kind of help hold product and it'll probably help it suds up a lot more too, so I thought these might be good to try out, so I got those. And then last but not least, actually I have two more things to show you, but this is the last thing from Family Dollar. I think a lot of you are going to be very happy to see this. This is a huge jug of Pinalin, Pinalin, I don't know how to pronounce it the correct way, but I've gotten quite a few requests to try this out and use it in videos. And like I told some of you, um, in the stores that I shop at, I usually can't find a normal sized bottle or the store just doesn't have it at all. So I had only seen this huge guy and I didn't really want to buy it and commit to this huge jug because I didn't know if I was going to like it. And to be honest, I had smelled it a few times in the store and didn't really care for the smell of it. But like I've been telling you guys over and over again recently that I'm learning not to judge a product or its scent by the way it smells out of the bottle in the store because when I take it home and clean with it, it tends to smell different and I usually like it a lot. So I decided to give it a try because I didn't know when I was going to even be able to find a decent, I mean a decent, a normal size bottle of this so I got this for five dollars from Family Dollar and I figured if I don't like it I could use it for paste making videos or maybe give it to somebody to use that does like it but I'm hoping it doesn't come to that because I really really want to like it so that's all from Family Dollar and then I stopped at Rite Aid and I was in there to get uh, something for my daughter and I just had to pick up my favorite powerhouse pine cleaner. You know, I'm not out of it, but I always like to keep at least like three or four backups of this. So I only had two, and I just picked up an extra one just to have it because I love it so much. Um, I love pine saw, but in my opinion, this smells better to me than pine saw. I think they both are good. I think they both serve a purpose. I always have both, but this is just my favorite cleaner in the world, so I always have this as well. So I suggest, I really recommend that you guys try this out if you can find it. I know it's a little bit harder to find than Pine Saw and stuff like that, but it's really good and it smells really awesome. So 
yeah, that's all I have to show you guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.